welcome my dear students first of all i would like to congratulate you now you have come to class 11th after passing class 10th this is going to be our first interaction so i hope you all are very happy today i'm going to start with the first poem of your book a photograph a photograph is actually not about only a simple rectangular or square cardboard a paper but it has a lot of meaning so let me begin your first chapter a photograph poetry 1 part 1 as you can see there is a picture of the poet shellet olson and a camera that shows that we are going to talk about a photograph First of all synopsis The poem photograph is a tribute to the poet's mother There are three stages of time span focused here First the poet's mother's enjoyment of past sea holidays with her cousins second stage takes us 20 or 30 years later and the third stage the poet remembers her dead mother with a heavy heart by the end of this lesson isrin shall be able to number 1 appreciate this poem and read aloud with proper intonation number 2 prepare poetic forms and adapt them with the figure of a speech rhyme and rhythm read and recognize the purpose of economy of words and the hidden pathos and nuances of the lines correlating them with author's background and personal experiences at last we shall be able to build up didactics empathy and sympathy with the loss of the speaker so let us begin recitation of this short and beautiful poem a uh, photograph the cardboard shows me how it was when the two girl cousins went paddling each one holding one of my mother's hands as she the big girl some 12 years or so all three stood still to smile through their hair at the uncle with the camera a sweet face my mother's that was before i was born and the sea which appears to have changed less washed there terribly 
transient feet some 20 30 years later she would laugh at the snapshot see betty and dolly she would say and look how they dressed us for the beach the sea holiday was her past mine is her laughter both re with the labored ease of loss now she has been dead nearly as many years as that girl lived and of this circumstance there is nothing to say at all its silence silences here at this point now she has been there was a mistake I have corrected either apostrophe is or has okay so this is a recitation let me continue with the poem summary this poem by Shirley Tolson is a tribute a tribute to her mother one day she finds an old photograph of her mother pasted on a cardboard sheet a photograph she remembered her mother talking about with fondness here one thing is very important the poem photograph is placed after the portrait of a lady because of the thematic relation between the two means the portrait of a lady that you will read in prose section and this chapter both are interconnected so let us begin the poem and its explanation the cardboard shows me how it was so this is actually example of illusion because cardboard lacks durability and the same thing is a hint for the lack of permanence of human life so it is example of illusion now the two girl cousins went paddling each one holding one of my mother's hands and the mother as the big girl was around 12 years or so at that time and all three are passing a smile through their hair as it is windy and they are standing still and the camera is in the hand of uncle at the uncle with the camera a sweet face and in that picture my mother's face is a sweet a beautiful face a loving face my mother's and this is all before I was before the poet was born so this way we have finished one part of this poem second part we will discuss in the next video i hope you will like it